Okay, so Lil Wayne the Carter 3 is officially 15 now. I mean, the hype this album had around it, only other album that was this hype was Get Rich or Die Trying. I mean, the Carter 3 is iconic. It got the hits. Lollipop, Got Money, Mrs. Officer, just hits on this album. A milli. But was it the best Carter? No. In my opinion, the Carter 2 is the best Lil Wayne we ever got. This Lil Wayne was still focused. You know, Carter 3 Lil Wayne is really when he got his wordplay bag. But the Carter 2 Wayne, he was in his wordplay bag, but it was still focused there. You know, Mo Fire, Money on My Mind, Fire Man, uh, Shooter. I mean, Lil Wayne, to me, this was his most focused album. I mean, Carter 3 is his thriller, but this... Carter 2 is this off the wall. This is Lil Wayne's best album. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Kiki Palmer has always been fine, but after this baby, Kiki Palmer is fine, fine. Now, that baby did her body wonders. I mean, she always had like a kitty vibe coming from her body, and I don't know if it's because, you know, we grew up watching Kiki, you know what I'm saying? You still seen Akila in the beat, but I don't see that no more. Kiki has grown into her adult woman body. And Kiki is one of the baddest in the game right now. I have to admit it. I have to admit it. Athletes are criticized and judged way too harsh. So Stephen A. Smith is going off now about Paul Pierce. And I'm like, what did Paul Pierce do? And I just looked at the video with Paul Pierce. He was literally just drunk with his friends talking crap. Now, if I can't be drunk, at my own, wherever the establishment was, they was an inside. It's not like he was out driving on strip nowhere. He was inside his crib. If I can't get drunk with girls and talk crap, what's really going on? Like, he's a grown man. He's not no little kid that's playing basketball no more. So I don't get, he said, it's concerned for his behavior. Is he legal to get drunk and have girls around and talk crap? Like, this is crazy to me. I think Stephen A is just so much of a square that any type of fun is bad to him. It's okay to have fun, Stephen. Okay, so Tupac's biological dad is not coming out saying he believed that Pac's murder was set up by the U.S. government. Now, most people, we gonna believe that, you know, it was the crypt member that Pac and his homies had jumped a couple hours before. But here's where the story does have some validity in what Tupac's dad is saying. Now... Mike Tyson title fight, a heavyweight title fight in the 90s. You telling me the Vegas script is going to be empty? When Tupac died on the Vegas script, the streets were empty. That right there is a red flag. How is the Vegas script empty after a heavyweight title fight? No names right now can fill up the Vegas script. And you telling me Mike Tyson didn't fill up the Vegas script? That part is always going to be suspect. And the only person that was on the street at the same time was an armed, drive, an armed killer. 